Hey guys, today I just wanted to make a video addressing a question that I've been getting a lot lately. And that question is, do you need a serger to sew swimwear? In most of my videos, I've been using a serger as you guys have probably seen, but I know that it's kind of an extra machine that you don't necessarily have on hand. Plus they can get expensive and they take up space and there's just a whole bunch of other factors. So I just wanted to make a video addressing that question to see whether or not a serger is actually right for you. So to start off, I'm gonna begin with the short answer. No, you do not need a serger in order to sew swimwear. And that is because if you have a regular sewing machine, you can always use a zigzag stitch, which does the job, but I will get more into that later. What makes swimwear unique to most other garments when sewing is that swimwear requires a lot of stretching. It hugs you really close to your body and it needs to be able to move as your body moves. Because of that, you do need a stitch that's going to stretch really well. And although a zigzag stitch does do the job just fine, the longer answer is that a serger is so much better for swimwear. Not only is a serger quicker and cleaner, but it's also able to make a four thread overlock, which is a stitch that has four different threads and it stretches very well. Sergers not only sew the fabric together, but they also clean up the edges at the same time, which leaves more room for error and it also gives it a professional finish. So is a serger right for you? If you plan on selling swimwear or making it for friends, yes. Save yourself the time and tears and blood and hatred and get yourself a serger. It will not only make your life so much easier, but the people who are receiving your garments will also notice that they're a lot better quality than if you just made them with a zigzag stitch. Sergers simply just have a better quality of stitch. So they're great for professionals and if you plan on sewing a lot. And even if you don't plan on making swimwear for others, you'd be shocked by how many projects you'll use the serger for. I seriously will use it just to finish off an edge in any project. And like, I cannot tell you the last project I've used that didn't involve the serger in some way, shape or form. Sergers just give such a professional finish that you will fall in love with it. Now, on the other hand, if you plan on making swimwear kind of here and there, it's not really something you're into, you just want to try it out, or you just want to save money before a vacation or something, then you can get by with a zigzag stitch. There's definitely nothing technically wrong with it. It's just in terms of quality, you can either be here or you can be way up there. So get a surgery if you can, but if you can't, don't stress. So in summary, no, you don't need a serger for sewing swimwear, but if you do plan on doing larger quantities of swimwear, it will save your life. Especially if you're just learning, sergers are the best way to go with swimwear. Be prepared to spend anywhere from $200 and up on a machine, and there's a little bit of a learning curve, so it might take you a couple of weeks to get used to the machine. But I can say it with full confidence, if you are a seamstress or you enjoy sewing, a serger will change your life and you will not regret the purchase.